Hi. I wanted to talk to you guys today about something I've been seeing on Facebook and a product that I wanted to see how well it worked. And it is the Beauty Bakery's Lip Whips. This is what it looks like. I got it in the mail the other day and I haven't tried it on yet. But I'm curious as, as to how well it holds up compared to our lip scents and if it really does all the stuff that it says. Now on the box it says that it is vegan. That's good. No calories. Well, that's good too. Um, smudge free liquid matte lipstick. And I got the color, where is the color? Cranberry Stiletto. So I'm hoping it's a good match for the Lip Sense Fly Girl. So I'm going to do half with the Lip Whip and half with the Lip Sense Fly Girl and we'll see how they compare. Um, I wanted to see what exactly it said about the Lip Whip because I really don't know a lot about it. It says the benefits that it is a long lasting smudge proof and waterproof. Don't worry about eating your makeup with our lip whips. They stay on your lips, not on your food. Well, that's good. Lip sits does that too, so we'll see. Um, apply your lip whip and leave it at home. Don't worry about reapplying. Okay, so one application is supposed to be good all day. And it's vegan. Good deal. Vegan is good. Uh, let's see what else it says. Tips. Exfoliate, which I did that when I put on my makeup, so we're good to go there. Um, allow five minutes for the product to dry for each coat applied. Wow. Five minutes. That's, that's, that's a pretty long time compared to the 10 seconds on our lip sense applications. What am I going to do for five minutes? Ooh. Please note, stickiness can result if product is not allowed to dry or if the product is layered with more than three layers. So I guess I can do more than one layer if I need to. Okay. Ingredients. Um, there's, there's a ton of stuff there. I don't know if you can see that or not, but there's... I can't read those words. Anyway, so I think we got the general gist of it, so let's see how it works. I think I want to start with the lip sense just because I'm familiar with that and I know how that's going to go. So since my lips are already exfoliated and dry, I'm just going to shake it well like we always do. Mix up the color. And Fly Girl is like one of my favorites, so. It's really hard just to do half your lip. I don't know that I've ever done that before. It's that's a little bit harder than you think because you just automatically want to go on and make it fixed. One layer.
there's three for Fly Girl. And of course, with lip sense, you gotta to top it off with your glossy gloss. So I got my glossy gloss. There we go. And everybody knows that wears lip scents that the glossy gloss seals in your color. Makes it look fabulous. So alright, now on do the lip whip. I'm kind of nervous. I don't know what to expect. I've heard it's really sticky. In five minutes. Oh my goodness. Okay. Doesn't say to shake it. There's no little shaker ball, so. Yes, we're good. This is what it looks like. It was $20, I think, so that's about comparable. Maybe just a little bit less than a color of lip scents. Um, it comes in, there's quite a few shades, 20 or so. Um, so let's see how it works. Oh, it's pretty bright. Hoping it matches. It's got a little applicator wand with a little divot in the middle. I don't know if you can see that. That's one coat. And I think I want to do, I don't know, two. So I've got to wait five minutes for this to dry before I can do a second coat. So I will see you again in a minute. Okay, it's been five minutes. Doesn't feel too sticky. Looks pretty matte. I'm going to add on a second coat just to get the coverage a little bit smoother. I feel like it's a bit splotchy in some places. Unfortunately, that means I have to wait another five minutes before we can even test it or know how it did. So, let's get this done. Okay, well the colors don't match up exactly, but that'll be okay. That's my second coat. Looks like I got some pretty nice coverage going on. So now we wait five more minutes for the second coat to dry. 
and I'll see you in five minutes. Okay, time's up. Let's see the preliminary how it does. Mmm. It feels the lips inside with the gloss feels nice and smooth and comfortable. The lip whip side feels I don't know how to explain it. It's not dry. It feels like it has a layer of like a thin rubber glove on my lip. Does that make sense? It's just like a couple coats of paint. I wouldn't say it's I wouldn't say it's uncomfortable. It's just maybe it doesn't feel as nice as my lip scent side feels. So, but it says it's it's smudge proof. So let's take a look at that. Let's go with the lip scent side first because I know how that's gonna go. So there's nothing, absolutely nothing but gloss on my lip scent side. Because we all know that lip sense is smudge proof and stays put when you put it on. Let's try the lip whip side. Well, hmm. <clears throat> I didn't rub it any harder than I rubbed the other side. It's definitely not sponge proof. And I set the timer on my phone. I did five layer, five minutes between each layer. This is not cool. I mean, granted, it's not on my tee. It doesn't feel, for the most part, like it's gonna go anywhere. But when you test it, it absolutely does. That's awful. And now look at it. Like, it looks gross now. It's not pretty. My lips inside is still pretty. And I can even put a gloss on top of that. Well, I've done smeared it now, but let's see if anything comes off on the glass, even though most of it's on my face and on my finger at this point. Mm. This is the lips inside. And this is the lip whip side. It definitely did come off. Their claim that this is smudge proof and lasts all day? No, no. There's, there's no comparison at all. They have pretty colors and the price was comparable. But the wait in five minutes was horrid, and this is unacceptable. It's just, nobody wants their face to look like this. So, moral of the story. Well, let's, I guess, try to take it off. Well, yeah. Ugh. Yuck. How cute is that? Not. Okay, so the war between Lip Whip and Lip Sense. Lip Sense is definitely the winner. Hands down. It's the best out there, the best I've found, and I wouldn't use anything else. Nobody wants their lips to look like this. So, lesson learned. Now we all know. So, have a good day. Bye.